The people must prove to the people that a brighter day is coming. Ooh. People must prove to the people that a day is coming. Good morning, y'all. Good afternoon. Good evening to you. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental house with me, your host, Khadija. Well, I guess a lot of us are beginning to realize now all those people that always go on the police, the police, the police. And well, as we can see what's happening in Uvalde, Texas, there's a police. Chief, that's AWOL, because he don't want to answer no more questions. Now, I said it before. I don't understand why some of these people aren't fired. I've said it. I've made it plain. You can't make it no more plainer. So what that tells me is these politicians are holding these people in high regard, no matter if they lie to you, no matter if they help your children meet the demise because they were afraid. Let me ask y'all something. Can you imagine being a fire, uh, a fireman and the building you were going to, uh, the house that you were going to was engulfed in flames and you could hear children screaming in the inside. See, I know what the great uh, firemen and women do in them situations. They are the brave civil service that they need to be. They go in. I'm sure a lot of them are afraid. I'm sure a lot of them are like, oh, no, it's really the grand finale or it's really the big one. But they do their jobs. I have never, ever, 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 ever heard a situation. <laughs> woo when the police don't want to go in, they get 40% of the budget of the states, just like in most states, the police departments get the majority of the money. And we are still allowing them to do none of the work or not what we pay them to do. That has got to stop. And every city in these United States All to take a um, a real hard look at what's happened down there in you uh, Baldy, Texas. Especially if you have children. Especially if you have children in this crazy society. You always have to look now for some nut to do some harm to you because. They're afraid they're going to be replaced. Up. And I'd like to uh, ask this real, real important question. How can you be replaced in a country that's not really yours? You're not Native and Indigenous. To, how crazy are you, white people? Here we go. How crazy are you? How are you going to claim some stuff that don't even belong to you and start talking about replacement theory the black man ain't going to replace you. God is going to replace you. God is replacing you because of your evil deeds. And now you want to blame somebody else. You never want to take responsibility. You don't want to take responsibility for slavery. You don't want to take responsibility for the hatred and the uh, just the whoremongering that you got. You don't want to take responsibility for nothing. And we see that. But I bet you you're going to take responsibility. You're going to take responsibility. Either you're going to take it voluntarily or it's going to come with a high price. Y'all, some lying, lying. Saxa, well, it, it rhymes with blitz. And that's exactly what y'all have done. And now you have no trust in the people. And the whole department should be Fired. Fired. Nobody have to, should have to subject themselves to y'all keystone cop asses. 
Goodbye, y'all. I'll see you in the next video.